Good evening, brethren, sisters, Church of the Living God. Hello. Yeah, um, this is going to be my second video for today, but I um, want to just uh, share something with you all. Pine needle tea. More on that in a moment. Can't do a video without any scripture. I've done that before, but I want to quote one verse of scripture. I'm going to put in the description box a um, video where I talk about, you know, going to natural remedies versus going to the medical establishment because the medical establishment is overrun with the Jesuit order. But um, Ezekiel chapter 47, verse 12, just one verse, one verse. Ezekiel chapter 47, verse 12. And by the river upon the bank thereof, on this side and on that side, shall grow all trees for meat, whose leaf shall not fade, neither shall the fruit thereof be consumed. It shall bring forth new fruit according to his months, because there, because their waters they issued out of the sanctuary, and the fruit thereof shall be for meat, and the leaf thereof for medicine. Mm. Anyway, um, as many of you may know, I have been having heart problems lately. Um, it's been over a week. Um, it's not going away, but the Lord has answered many prayers, and please continue to pray for your servant, and as we pray for so many of you, please. But um, this has been a really rough week for me and for my wife, uh, as far because of what's been going on with me. Um, it's attributed to bad diet, um, pr primarily, and um, just things catching up to me. But um, I want to just share with you some of the things I've been doing um, and some things that more recently uh, really, really helped uh, to where there was almost immediate results in the positive way. The one drawback is that I'm not sleeping that well. <laughs> I'm having a really hard time sleeping. So please keep me in prayers, if you will. But anyway... Um, I just want to share with you a few things, and you know, got some, got quite a few emails I want to go through tonight and check these out. And it takes time to read these emails, so. Um, but I know that there are several of you of the Church of the Living God who are also having problems with your heart, and are also pro having problems with your lungs and stuff like that. And there is actual evidence out there that can still be found today um, that being around people who have been in, uh, in league with the steel of the Jesuit Bunyard, um, there are certain things that those people, because they have come in contact with that, make it kind of hazardous for us who will not. Something to keep in mind something to keep in mind but um, I want to share with you some of the things that I have been doing and they have been helping and uh, like I said um, I do know of for for example um, my one brother Jeff and my dear brother from um, from Europe and also brethren here in um, my own country um, there are many of us that are suffering with heart problems and whatnot. But um, one of the things is, uh, well, this right here, what I'm drinking is called pine needle tea. It's very healthy for you. And uh, this is what I got. Now, as you can see, I got this off of Amazon. This is the only thing that's in English, okay? And it, uh, this comes in, you know, one of these, and um, very good, very good. Um, I've, I've been using this now for, this is day two that I've been using these. Um, it helps, it helps. 
Um, and also, too, you can do your own research on pine needle tree, um, pines and spruces. Paid, I got two of these, and I paid quite a bit of money to get those, but then the brother's like, you know, they're outside. It's indigenous to wherever you are. And I went outside on my property here where we live, and spruce pine, uh, pine trees there, spruces there, spruces there, surrounded by them. And it's very simple. You just take a pocket knife, cut them off, and then pluck off the, the uh, needles, boil them, and then drink it. Very healthy for you. And spruce trees and pine trees, I'm going to put a link in the description box so you can uh, um, know which is which. But the spruce and the pine, very beneficial. Very, very beneficial. Um, also, too... This, this bothers me. See that? Yeah. Yeah, that bothers me. But um, these are organic fennel seeds. Um, organic fennel seeds um, help with blood thinning. And the, uh, the, the pine tree, uh, pine needle tea stuff um, is very high in uh, vitamin C. There's also another natural chemical in them, which I cannot remember that is very helpful to you as well that can um, possibly help combat spike proteins possibly okay this tastes like licorice and what I did yesterday while we were having a fellowship with some brethren um, I got this stuff yesterday I took a spoonful of this and started one of these and I had been doing okay but within a half an hour of taking a teaspoon of this and drinking some of this it was amazing I felt normal normal meaning before my heart problems and whatnot I, it was amazing it was very quick it was very quick and it's I'm still feeling very well today um, like I said sleeping has been an issue but um, I do recommend this. Uh, what I have done, what I do is just take a spoonful, put it in there and just uh, chomp on it. It tastes like lic licorice. I love it. Okay. Very good. Uh, pine needle tree. You're going to have to, um, uh, pine needle tea, excuse me. Um, you're going to have to look this up on your own. I'm going to put a link for you to look that up. But also, like I said, organic fennel seed. Good for blood thinning. This, that bothers me, but it's very good. This, 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 they're little things, look at that, they're little um, star-shaped little seedlings or whatnot, um, very good, very good. Uh, star anise, um, make sure you get organic. I also took two of these yesterday. Uh, one while I was talking to a brother. You can overdo these. <laughs> I overdid it with this yesterday because it was the first day and I, you know, I didn't know what to do or how to take it. But um, you can overdo it on these. These also help with blood thinning and also are very good in um, uh, other things such as vitamin D and calcium and what. You can look this up on your own time, but this... This works. This worked for me. Okay, the whole week, the whole past week, it was um, having some horrible nights where I thought I was literally going to die. And um, thank you for the prayers. But um, I was recommended by a beloved brother who came around back around at just the perfect time. And um, yeah, this helped. But you can overdo this. Um, there is. It says in this that there's no caffeine. But it was kind of a stimulant in a way for me because I was very restless and I didn't sleep well last night. But um, yes, this is what I've been using. This is what I've been using. Okay. Um, as far as how much you take, you're going to have to figure that one out on your own <laughs> because um, I don't know what to take. I know, um, I do know that you can overdo it on this. Okay. You can overdo it on this. And... This one especially, when you eat it, just put it in your mouth and start chomping on it. Um, it made my mouth a little numb. 
and the, my esophagus as well. And um, very tasty, tastes like licorice as well. Also, too, a beloved brother recommended this. See that? I was at first taking this two times a day, but uh, now what I am doing is I, I take it in the morning with water. Um, I was I was trying it, uh, taking it at night before I go to bed, but not the best decision to do. But um, a brother who has also been through the same kind of things that I'm going through, uh, this other brother though, um, beloved brother, had a uh, heart attack. I don't think I did. Um, I, I really don't. I could have. I don't know. But um, very good. See that? You can get this off of Amazon. Okay. I have sent this to several people, the link for this. This right here. See that? I'm not going to even try to pronounce that. Um, I've been taking this too in the morning as well seems to be working magnesium magnesium is very very good for the heart very good for the heart uh, this is what I got uh, you can get magnesium where uh, other types of it and whatnot uh, this is a 500 milligram um, here in my nation especially with the genetically modified food industry and whatnot and the fact that uh, you know that's about you Europeans <laughs> You guys really don't have hardly any GMOs, but here in America, we're overloaded with them. Um, that has to do with the Jesuit order wanting to kill us all Americans and whatnot. But magnesium is very, where's the label, is very good for the heart. And also, been taking krill oil. Now, I used to do just other kind of fish oil, but uh, my wife gave me these because she, it tastes pretty fishy. But... Um, Yes, this is also helps for circulation and also uh, this, the omega-3 uh, EPA and DHA, whatever that is, has been helping as well. But the things that worked immediately for me mixed together was the pine needle tea and this, this, the fennel, uh, organic fennel, and also uh, this stuff, but yet, you know, Having uh, fennel seeds and then eating two of these in one night, wouldn't recommend it. Wouldn't recommend it. But what I've been doing in the morning is um, when I wake up, I take I take these. Uh, this this one apparently you can take up to three to four times a day. Um, today I've only taken one in the morning. Uh, this I take take this this and this in the morning along with a, another multivitamin and whatnot that I take okay I take that in the morning and then sometime during the day um, I'll, I'll warm me up some pine needle tea and then I will uh, sometime like this today I took this in the afternoon about I don't know uh, sometime uh, after I had done the first video and this one I'm not going to take today but I'm going to alterate, uh, alterate with these and whatnot. This one too, this is from China. Apparently there is a Japanese star anise that is very toxic. Be careful of that. But um, these have been very helpful to me. Very helpful. And um, the thing too about the pine needles, um, what, look at the link that I'm gonna give you. <coughs> um, with that, where we have like spruces and pine trees here around this property you can you can go we did this this morning my wife and i um you can go outside take a little pocket knife cut off a little branch and then what you do is with the pine thing you like do this take them off take them off don't put the whole like tree branch in there or whatnot but you take them off take them off take them off uh, i got me a little baggie of pine needles here and I mean we can get them at our leisure and in the video I'm going to be linking in the description box talks about you know God's remedies are out there and lo and behold all the while you know unfortunately I did spend I spend uh, to get this but now I know that um, 
you know, that they're around here and indigenous, um, just go and, like I said, make sure you do it like that. Take the needles off, boil them. Um, kind of tastes a little bland, tastes a little minty, but it helps. I'm telling you, um, I had been having really like a, like a wave, up and down, up and down, up and down. Um, and there have been a few nights uh, where I was really horrible. And there was the one night um, that I really thought I was going to go home. And uh, praise the Lord I didn't because for my wife's sake, okay? Like I said, uh, yesterday I got that um, fennel seed and this, and within a half an hour, instant, like not instantly, but it was like, wow. I even said to my wife during the um, uh, time that we were talking with the brother and sister, I was like, wow, I feel normal. Normal meaning before the heart attack stuff. And I didn't have a heart attack, I don't think. But um, anyway. Anyway. <laughs> I just wanted to share that with you. Um, do your own research. I can't tell you your what dosage is. Because I'm kind of in the stages right now. Figuring out what works and what not to do. And <laughs> how not to do certain things. Um, uh, like I said, this is going to be this is gonna be it. I'm not taking anything else. Um... There's really nothing, um, for example, like um, magnesium will help with your heart, but that's over time. It's nothing immediate. It's a buildup. Um, the krill oil, eh, don't know. This doesn't, I don't know if it works right away. This, that my brother, our, our brother, excuse me, our brother recommended, this works. This works uh, right away. You can feel it. You can feel it. This, um, uh, I drink this in the morning, and uh, it's like, ooh, kind of, I can feel it. So this is an instantaneous uh, kind of thing. Um, it doesn't, like, it's hard to describe what it actually does, but you can feel it right away. These guys, these work fairly quickly fairly quickly and coupled them with pine needle tea brother Jeff brother Jeff love you get these try these okay only do one of these a day by the way like I said I did two within a within a span of three hours and I was it, there's no caffeine in it but it was kind of like a stimulant anyway um, so, but yes, I, I just wanted to share this with you, brethren, for those of you who are having health problems similar to mine, and also stuff maybe with your lungs and circulation. There is stuff out there, brethren. There is stuff out there. Um, a brother of ours um, gave a wonderful testimony about, you know, he had a heart attack and never went to an never went to a hospital, never went to a doctor. And um, beautiful, beautiful brother. And uh, beautiful sister, too. Beautiful brethren. Um, and he had mentioned, it's like you tell people that you, you know, you're having these things and you haven't gone to a doctor. They look at you like, what? But what can you do today? You know? Especially with what's coming down the pipe. So, anyway, that is going to be it. I, I do have, uh, I do have work to do, a lot of emails to look over, and um, just thank you. Thank you to all of you. Thank you for your prayers. Please continue to pray for us. Uh, this ain't over. I hope I get a good night's sleep tonight. Um, pray for the babes in Christ. Please pray for the babes in Christ. Um, they are the ones that the devil and the coadjutors are going after. So, Anyway, that's going to be it. Very quick. Not even 20 minutes. Thank you. I love you. We love you. And we'll see you in the next video, okay?